Rick Ninja Productions back with another video and today I'm going to re be reviewing the Transformers Constructabot Decepticon Drag Strip. Now I've never heard of Drag Strip. I, I haven't seen them in like any of the uh, tra early Transformers cartoons, the ones that came earlier. So yeah, I don't know who this guy is or what he is what he does in the series and uh, but uh yeah uh, this is basically my third Constructabot figure now at first like I said in my other reviews and that's my chair creaking again um, I have, I wasn't really sure about these guys, but after I got the two-pack with Optimus and Megatron, I was like, mm, you know what, I was wrong, these guys are really, actually awesome. But yeah, this is my third one. I might get another, don't know when, but I might get one, another one, one day. But still... And yes, that was my hand doing something. Yeah. I had to fix this little thing. I didn't have to, but oh well. Anyway, let's get on with him. Now he's actually actually a bit longer. Oops, longer than the other two I reviewed, Optimus and Megatron. Um, he has purple. And orange as well as black and red. I think it's yeah, he's meant to be a race car. I mean, he does not represent race car at, basically at all. So, yeah, it kind of sucks, but still not bad. He, he rolls, so that's good. Not much else to say though. It's it's supposed to be a race car. That's it. So anyway, let's transform him. This might be a bit difficult because you know what? Screw it. I'll do it. All right, you. God damn it! Screw that. Had moved out of the way. Um, oops. Anyway, transform them. You unclip this from the back, like so. Move them, move these out to the side, like that. And like that. Bring the hands, all right, you can see that. Bring the hands down, fold them out. Bring them down, fold them out, unpeg them from here, and move those out to the side. Unpeg this from here and separate them. These will be its legs. The transformation is very similar to the Optimus and Megatron constructor bots I did. Yeah. Separate them, bring down the legs, turn the waist around. Fold it up. Oops. Popped off. But it goes right back on. And again, fold it up. Bring the feet down. Rotate them. Down. Rotate. And he's actually bringing it a bit taller now. Bring the arms down like so. And rotate these out, out, out of the way. Bring this piece, and you want if you want, you can remove this piece right here. This will be his weapon in robot mode. Set that off to the side. Oops. 
So I had to look at the picture because I thought I got his feet wrong, but no, I didn't. And fold this back. Or fold this front panel down. And it's a lot more harder to bring down than the other two. <clears throat> Seriously, it feels like you're about to break it. But anyway, bring the chest down, fold up the head, bring this back up, and then you can fold this piece down. And there's the drag strip. Like I said, I have not heard of this guy, so I don't know much about him. No, I don't know him at all, actually. And this front race car thing can be a weapon. You can hold it in his hand like so. So yeah, there he is. And unlike up the Megatron one, his Decepticon symbol doesn't have that type of white paint. So, yeah, and the sculpting's there, but the white paint is not. So that's kind of lame. And, uh, ah. he actually has a teeth gritting face, though it's hard to see. But it's still. And, uh,. Yeah, it's basically the same thing as Optimus and Megatron, just parts are different and the coloring is different. And of course the head's different. But anyway, take that out. Let's go to articulation. His head can move his side to side a lot easier. Actually, it can go up, it can kind of go down on the on the ball peg as well as the hinge. His arms can fully rotate. I think you go in and out, bend at the elbow, bends at the wrist here and here, and it can rotate at the wrist. Again, if you unclip this, then you have waist articulation. But, uh, his legs can move forward, back, in and out, bend at the knee. Bend at the foot here, and here, and I'll show you better. You can bend it side to side and rotate it. So yeah, same articulation as the other two, but uh, okay. Never heard of this guy, so yeah. If anyone, if if one of you can tell me in the comments who this guy is, I'd appreciate it. But yeah, there's Drag Strip. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you next time.